Hello everybody, this is Drew Naylor, and today I'm going to show you how to make the cinnamon clock applet look like the Windows clock and how it has on two lines. At the end of the video I'll also show you how to take the default one and then put that on two lines. But what I'm focusing on is how to make it look like the Windows clock like this. I'm going to change it back to the defaults and then show you how to do this. Now this is what it looks like by default. It has the day of the week, month, day of the month, comma, and then the time. And this just displays in 12 hour time because I assume I set it to that, I don't know. To have it display like that, I don't know. So what you want to do is you want to right click, configure, check use a custom date format, and then when you click that it changes it to 24 hour time. That, that doesn't really matter. Now what we want to do, I have a file right here that I wrote up plus the explanations for it. For now we want to focus on Windows Select. I'll get to the default but on two lines after I'm done with the Windows Select one. Now what we want to do is highlight this, delete it, and then type percent lowercase l which is the hour of the day for 12 hour clock and we want to do a colon and then percent capital M which is the minute of the hour and then we want to do a space percent lowercase p which is your meridian indicator uppercase if you do capital P that does lowercase and then we'll want to do percent n for a new line you'll want to be watching down here if you aren't already for as you type this up here you'll change down here and then you want to do a space percent lowercase m for the uh, month number zero padded and then a forward slash and then percent lowercase d for a zero padded day of the month. Now what zero padded means is that it, it shows up a number a zero in front. Instead if we wanted to use e which is the day of the month but space padded it puts a space in front of it but I don't like it like that. You can choose to have it like that if you want. I personally don't so I won't. And then we want percent capital Y for the year number, the full year number as four digits. So that's what it'll look like. I'll put this in the description if along with this explanation of the different things in it. I'll also put the default in there too if you want to get back to the default. But yeah this will be in the description so that you can just copy and paste it right into here. See there it's that. And you can just highlight this, copy, I'm gonna clear everything in here, then paste and it just shows it like that. You can also do other things in the show information and date format syntax that will give you more information about it, but I don't want to do that right now because that's more complicated. If instead of the Windows format you want it to be the default but on two lines, we'll get rid of this, type percent capital H colon percent capital M and that gets you the time. This is 24 hour time. I'll also show you the 12 hour time if you want it 12 hour time but default. The default on two lines but 12 hour time. Kind of a hybrid of the two in a way. So then we'll want to do percent lowercase n for a new line space percent capital A, comma, space, percent capital B, okay, percent capital H is hour of the day, 24 hour clock, percent M is minute of the hour, just like this one, percent N again is new line, percent capital A is the day of the week, fully spelled out, percent B is the month name, fully spelled out, it's good I'm not doing in this, this in May because May, May spelled out and abbreviated is the same thing and then space percent lowercase e gives you the day of the month with a space instead of a zero so that's how it'll look like if instead of 24 hour time you want 12 hour time kinda like if you turn the custom thing off how it shows you that you'll want to go over here to the capital H, change that to lowercase l, and then I was going to go to the end of the line, but it doesn't, the new line character doesn't really change this text box here. 
So you want to go after the percent capital M, do a space, percent lowercase p, and that changes it to 12 hour time, and then a new line, the day of the week, and the month, and the day of the month. So I hope this video helped you. Please let me know if you need anything else in the comments, and uh, goodbye for now.